but now they've actually talked to each other rather, rather than being isolated. Though they talk to each other, they know each other, they can now act as a chain of trust. So now we get on to Act 4. And in Act 4, it's DNS, DNSSEC saves the day. So we'll repeat the, the transaction from before. We'll show the DNSSEC table. Okay, back to banking again. More bills. We're shopping here. Okay. www.bigbank.com. That's right, Peter. Thank you, Joe Usher. I don't have that information in my cache yet again. So I need to resolve this information. And I'm going to go to the root for the information for www.bigbank.com's address. Hey, Mr. SP, you start to be a real pain. Um, yeah. I'm afraid I don't know the address of www.bigbank.com, but I can point you at .com, which is one dot one dot one dot one. Thank you. I can trust this information. I can tell you. And by the way, don't you know anything? <laughs> I now trust that I can go to 1.1.1.1 for the information for www.bigbank.com. Hello.com, do you have the information for www.bigbank.com? Well, I don't have that address, but I can tell you that bigbank.com's authoritative server is at 2.2.2.2. And I'm sure about that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let me just shake hands on that. Thank you. I now have the address for the name server for www for sorry for bigbank.com. Hello bigbank.com. I need the address for www.bigbank.com. Hello and welcome back. The, the IP address for www.bigbank.com is 6.6.6.6. Oh, no, it isn't. I can't validate the information. I didn't get a handshake from you. So, I need the information for www.bigbank.com. Thank you again for asking the information for www.bigbank.com is 2.2.2.3, and you can trust that. Thank you very much. We now have the address for www.bigbank.com. Very nicely put in the certificate. You can all trust the information. It has been DNSX signed. Joe Usher, go ahead and spend some money. Great. Thank you, Mr. ISP. Now I'm off to 2.2.2.3 with confidence. And I can do my banking, and life is all good. So that, that was really it. So on the last thing, I, I, I think when the, on the whole exercise, one of the important things to see is as the user, um, I don't have to worry too much about it. It's the same about the recursive servers and authorities and everything else. Uh, but the user, not too much to worry about other than, and you can, um, other than relying on your ISP to make sure you balance. So um, that's it. Yeah.